Hello, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm gonna do a Rambler Reno update. So right now we are pre-plumbing. Stay tuned. Okay, so um, I'm gonna show you a video of where we are so far. Um, basically we have the uh, Joyce all in. Um, we had the HVAC guys out and you know, maybe not surprising, there was a complication, of course. Um, and I'll go into it a little bit more um, in depth in the video, but basically what we have is, is we have some existing ductwork underneath our house. And when we purchased the house, we actually had all of that ductwork service. So they went through and they like rewrapped all of it and insulated it and insulated the floors and put it, you know, redid the whole crawl space and everything. And um, we're like, awesome, right? And so what we wanted to do is we wanted to move the location of where the old furnace was into this new space. And you know, it's kind of odd. I mean, I, you know, you know, it's not that odd. You know, it's odd in some ways and in other ways, I'm not really that surprised, okay? But basically the HVAC guys came out and they were like, we can't do this. <laughs> um, and so, um, essentially we are going to, um, they're going to coordinate having a concrete cutter come in and they're going to blow a hole into the, uh, concrete. Um, so you're not going to see that in this video, but, um, I think they're going to be coming, um, soon, I hope in the next day or two to come and put this hole in the concrete. And, uh, when they have that hole in the concrete, I'll make a video so you guys can see it. So anyway, let me, let's just get to the video so you guys can see it. Um, and, uh, so. Uh, let's do that. Let's just get to the video. Here it is. All right, everybody. So it's kind of hard to see in here because it is a dark day. Our nice, wonderful, sunny days kind of wore themselves out. But let's see. Maybe I can get an angle here. So here's what we have is, is this is these two things here. There's one here and one here are the gas lines. One going to the furnace and one going to the hot water heater. Um, so those are now in, which is great, and that means that we also have the gas line in for the um, the range. So let's see. Well, there's all kinds of like crazy complications. So basically, <laughs> yesterday morning when uh, the HVAC guys showed up, they were expecting there to be a hole here. And it's really dark, but if you look down here, there's no hole. It's just ground. It's concrete. So that was a problem. A little itty bitty problem. And, you know, not good, basically. So, let's see what I can tell you about it. So I think the issue is being solved, but basically the problem is, is that we need to have some way to get the ductwork uh, reconnected between the uh, furnace and the uh, ductwork that's existing underneath the house. So, I think that's gonna happen. Um, and, yeah, actually here, the lighting is a little bit better and you can see a little bit better what we've got. Uh, but basically, that's where we are. Let's see, so, um, and if we look over here, this is where the gas line comes in. Um, it shoots up into the attic area and goes across um, over to where you saw it. And so there's a, I think a couple steps in the crawl space as well for later things. And that's all I have for you. Okay, so you saw it, all right. Um, yeah, so that's where we are. I mean, the progress, I don't know, it seems kind of slow. It's a little bit stalled right now, which is maybe not unusual for a renovation um but it's moving along still and uh yeah so i think as soon as we get that hole put in um i mean that'll make a big difference and we'll be pretty excited about that that way we can reconnect that duct work i mean the hvac guy was like well maybe what we should do is just redo all your duct work in the attic and hillary and i were like uh that's not gonna work um and after he went down into the crawl space and looked, he was like, oh, I see why you guys want to use your existing ductwork because it's all nicely rewrapped. Well, of course we did. So, um, yes. So that 
is my video. Um, please subscribe to my channel, um, like the video, follow me on Facebook, and head over to my website, ashleybolden.com, and I will see you again soon on YouTube.